Hey there, it's Caitlin McDonald with the Social Speak Network. And today we're going to be talking about something that quite a few of our clients have been asking about recently. And that is how to make multiple pages password protected without utilizing a plugin that creates memberships or different user levels. Um, and so we found a great plugin. It's called Protect the Children. Um, where basically you add a password to the parent page and then all of the sub pages or children pages all have the um, same password to protect them so that somebody doesn't need to go in and enter the same password, you know, 50 times to visit all 50 different pages. So let me jump on over and share my screen and we'll be able to walk through how to utilize this plugin. Okay. So, oops, here we go. So this is the plugin, Protect the Children, and super simple to utilize. Um, it does, I believe, say, okay, it does say that's compatible with this version of WordPress. I feel as though the, the newer versions of WordPress it might say that it's untested. We haven't had any conflicts um, with it yet, but if you do, please leave a comment. Um, I'd love to update this video with a different plugin to use. Um, but this is the one that we have utilized in the past. So it's just clicking to install it, activate. Okay. So I added this new page, example, private page with Lorem Ipsum. I'm just going to refresh it so that we now see this option here for password protected. And going to do example password as the password. And we're going to have this say password protect all child posts. So basically what this does is it creates it so all of the children are automatically password protected. So example child. So I'm just going to add another page right here. And we're going to select the example private as the parent page and click publish. Okay. So let's view page for this example private and it should ask us, yep, to put in our password. Whoop. Example PW and enter. And now we can see that page. Now, since I have um, entered in the password, we will now be able to open up this child page and see that post. However, if I were to open up an incognito window and just try and go to that child page, it would ask me for the password. So let's, again, just test this out. So we plug in that example WP, it allows us to see this. Then let's go to that parent page and it will also allow us to see that parent page. Um, so you only, users will only need to enter in that password once and then they'd be able to go to all of the different pages. So again, the plugin that we're using is Protect the Children. You can just do a, a search from the plugin, um, add new for Protect the Children. Uh, there are other password protected plugins that do exist on WordPress. We've just found this one to be very straightforward and very simple. Um, and so here, just to kind of take a look at the settings, so we have that example child page, visibility, it automatically was set to password protected and say password protected by parent post. So I hope that this has been helpful for you. Please let me know if you have any questions about how to utilize the Protect the Children plugin in order to password protect multiple pages on your WordPress website. Thanks.